Okay, so with that interruption out of the way, let's see if I can figure out how the freaking to factory factory town. So, I mean, honestly, at this point, it almost seems like a mistake to have this entire setup out here. When I really should move it up here. Do we have any stone? We have stone. Okay. This is a giant mess, and I hate it. So I'm going to move this guy over here. I'm going to keep my pastures here, because it seems most useful. Let's see, the farm is fine, but we don't want the workshop. I'm going to leave the rest of this. I might fix it. Uh, fix it later. Let's get the proper thing. So we want we want a workshop here. Just right there. Okay, so to get this, we need a workshop. Okay, so this is a cloth conveyor belt factory. So we need cloth, wheels, and stone. So cloth is easy. Oh, okay, well sort of. Wheels, less easy. Stone, relatively easy. Okay. So we're going to want... Cloth is at another workshop. Wheels at this workshop. And stone. Oh. Okay, we want the stonemason over here. Okay. Okay. So, we want to have a chute. Luckily, the chute is at the top of a hill. Uh, let's see. Can I can I rotate? We want to do tools flatten up. I want to just get this hill to be nice and even so I can shoot down it no problem. Ah, dang it. Tools flatten up. Because, yeah, effectively what I want to do is just run all of my stone down this, this set of chutes. Okay, so you are going to send it down. You too, because I don't think we need that much stone. So this will be two. This will output stone bricks. Now, we don't actually have... We don't actually have um, conveyors yet. Which means I'm going to have to have some guy just running around grabbing all of these things. Okay. So, wheels and cloth. The wheels on the cloth go round and round. Let's start with um, cloth, probably. And you are going to be wooden wheels. Which means we need a lumber mill over here. I'm going to put it all the way out there. Let's see, and I'm sure planks don't count as as resources to work with here. Okay, so we need cloth. So what we need is farming. Okay, we we should have fertilizer at this point, yeah. We should. Where's it all been going? Oh, the farms are eating it. Okay, can I turn off... Well, we can do apply water, but we don't want fertilizer. But that's something. We should also uh, get some water out here. Maybe? We don't need them immediately. But I can kind of do this. Okay. So, cart is confused. But that's fine. So now we should start stacking a little bit of fertilizer. I hope. Okay, good. So now now it should actually properly output. Okay, so this is a lumber mill. So you guys are still going pretty dang well. Where's that? Okay. You need to deliver it to the lumber mill. Lumber mill is going to make planks. Plank! See, it's not producing fertilizer, it's making leather. No, it does both. It does leather and fertilizer. 
The animals have to poop before they get killed and get turned into my, my couch. Let's see. So, question for what happened to, uh, oh boy. Uh, okay, well, let's respond to this first, maybe. Let's see. Oh god, there's so many more. Yep. I have a need for poop. Give me. Okay, that's a bunch of leather. You know, we might actually be able to sell that leather now that I'm thinking about it. Alright, whatever. Uh, let's see. So we want to get buildings a farm. Okay. So I'm going to put a farm there. Now, the farm doesn't necessarily need water, but it, I'm going to give it some water anyway. Let's do terrain block up and just bring it down. Okay, so this way we just have infinite water. And we want to do farming. We want to plant cotton. Oh, can only place on a farm tile. Well, that's fine. I can actually get farm tiles now. Yes! I can't do much, but it's okay. We really don't need that much cotton yet. Okay. Ah, blah, blah, blah. Okay, there we go. So you're you're working on that. So we should end up with some cloth. It's going to take some time before this is done growing. Never mind. Actually, it doesn't take much time at all. Convenient. Uh, let's see. Farming. Farm tile. I need more poop. Poop harder, creatures. Okay. So we got the stone mason, we've got the stone brick, but it's not outputting any, but that's fine. Uh, let's see. And I'm pretty sure planks don't do... Planks don't do the whole shoot thing, unfortunately. Okay, so what is, what is not doing anything useful? I don't know. Stuff's kind of just going. Get a wagon. Wagon! I'm just gonna tell it to supply. If it pulls from elsewhere, so be it. Should be fine. At least for a little while. Alright. So, we've got that. So now all we need is probably one dude. You. Let's just have him supply workshop. Okay, this wagon is not doing anything useful. But that should be okay. Uh, let's see. So, paths, road. We want to go around. Then at some point, we're going to do conveyors. Okay. How are you doing? So, we might need one more guy here. And at some point, I'm going to just do all conveyors here. See, is there a point to this game where just an end goal... Uh, currently, I don't think there's much of one, unfortunately. Ugh. But it's fun. I mean, it's really chill. Which is really all it needs to be. Okay. So we don't, we don't need this guy here. You should probably cut trees. Okay. Deliver there. Deliver there. Hopefully the shoot will work. But yeah, this is going to be a lot like Factorio, where it's just a purely early access title. And there's going to be a lot, lot wrong with it, a lot that's not done with it. Uh, but it's pretty good. I don't know. As far as, like, Factorio clones go, I think the only one that's going to end up being better than this one, uh, apart from Factorio itself, is... Uh, it's satisfactory. Satisfactory, very, very possibly, is probably... Good God. Uh, satisfactory is probably going to uh, to blow all of them out of the water. Maybe. Unless it works poorly, at which point, I don't know. We'll all be depressed, I guess. 
I, I think I think you guys are straight up giving up like giving out like a hundred subs today. I not even exaggerating here. That's ridiculous. Thank you. Thank you so much. And to those of you on YouTube, thanks for just being around. You're also cool. Even though I can only respond to some some comments here and there. What is up with these roads? What's going on? Alright, whatever. I guess I'll just put a road there. Eventually I'm gonna just start doing conveyors, but still. Okay. Uh let's see. So what do we do next? Are we still researching? We're still researching medicine. It's probably because I don't have anything immediately to feed into it. What sells for things? Uh, we do have cloth. Cloth might be a bad idea. Uh, might not be a bad idea. Oh. This workshop is actually suddenly kind of meaningless. What do we do with it then? Well, actually, we could make some clothing. Because clothing is worth 10 and only cost me two cloth. Uh, buh, 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 buh. Do we have a splitter yet? You don't have any farms supplying cloth to the rest of the town now. Yeah. It's all just going into this workshop, which isn't great. Which means, option A, I rebuild my original cloth farm down here, and like loop it around, or I figure out how to how to do a splitter. Do we even have one of those? Because we have the con cloth conveyor belt. Hmm. It's it's, hmm, because it's probably under advanced logistics. Okay, have I missed anything else? Not yet. That's good. Y'all are scaring me. Because, uh, yeah, we have all this extra cloth that we don't need. Yeah, there's, there are, oh, logistic blocks. Barrier gate. One way. So we also have the rail stop. Sorter, pusher, grabber, splitter. We want the splitter next. Ow. Ow, I just kicked... I just kicked the desk. It hurts. Uh-huh. Owie. Owie. Okay. Let's see, make an intersection. I could try. I'm not entirely sure what it would do. Because I think making an intersection means it's just going to go past. No? It actually looks like it'll go both ways. Hmm. Well, we don't even need the cloth here. What we actually need is almost easier. Paths, road. Okay, so I'm gonna make another, gonna make another workshop. I'm just gonna make this one here. Whoops, no. We don't, we, oh. We don't want blue though. We want shirts. Let's see. I'm going to want to rip this up and change this around pretty quick. Actually, we totally can, like, right now. We want to move that over. We've got the food market. We've also got the grain mill. So... Can we do filters? Not in the way that I want. What we need is a sorter. So actually, where'd that wagon go? You should probably not do that. We are, we are going to need this for a little bit longer, at least until we can get a, advanced logistics. Okay. So what horrible surprises do we have waiting for me? I don't see it yet. Okay. Gotta be wary. It's like, it's like Dark Souls, uh, not Dark Souls, Dead Souls all over again. It's like, I know it's coming. I, I know a Necromorph's gonna pop out of nowhere and then chuck a hundred bucks at me. And then I'm gonna be like, buh. And that's just, that's just gonna be how it goes. Okay. 
Well, I could just get another worker for the time being. Uh, but then I need a wagon to foot smith smith. <sighs> hmm. Because I can fit some more houses. We could just delete all these trees. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Shady Book, for the seven month resub. So close to a year, yet so far. That's closer than you think, honestly. Uh, time time really does kind of fly. It's a little spooky as as an adult, as I get older, time time flies faster, and I'm like, no, stop doing that. At the same time, life is good. Mostly good. Hmm. I'm just trying to think, because until we get the better uh, conveyor belts, we're kind of locked in here. So what is this guy doing? So he's outputting grain. This wagon doesn't need to be here. I'm going to send it to the general store. We're, we can just get a regular worker. And we're just going to supply the, that workshop. Okay, so it's not, it's not pretty. But once we start getting some conveyors going... Actually, how many conveyors are we even looking at this, at this point? Uh, can I, can I check? I got 22, so we could actually potentially do stuff. Oh, we just need those splitters. I wonder if, uh, you can jam the wrong thing into some of these houses. Probably. Okay. Well, that's a bit better. We should probably get rid of this barn. I'm not immediately using it. Okay, uh, let's see. So we can make poultice, medical wraps, antidote, ointment, mana purification. So that is a good good use for this thing. Because this thing is... Okay, here we go. So bandages, red. Poultice. I didn't have to make the bandages first. It requires cloth. No! Okay. I need some tears. We need some splitters. I might almost have to rethink this whole setup, because I was originally doing this as just a basic feeder system to make the conveyor belts, but that's very clearly not a good idea. Maybe? I don't know. Anyway. Ugh. Cloth conveyor belts. Okay, wagon, you are free. So, now what do we do? Well, we just finished research, which is good, actually, because what we, we want to do is intermediate logistics. Let's see. We should have enough. So we don't have enough population to buff that up even further. However, what we do have is a bunch of houses that could use some cloth here. I'll have to figure out how to route some cloth properly properly to the base. But we might as well expand our, our housing situation as necessary. Okay, so that looks like that's the most I'm going to be able to get, at least for a bit. Okay. And yeah, thank you, Nebula87, for the two-month resub. Such a wonderful streamer, Wander. Keep on keeping, my dude. Yeah. Oh, man, I can't wait to keep on keeping with a couch. Uh... I mean, I, I've talked about this constantly, but I, uh, I I really want a couch for what should be mildly obvious reasons. Can I upgrade a barn? No. What can I upgrade? There are a couple of things that are... Okay, so you can upgrade a pasture. Not a barn, not a lumber mill, not a general store. You can upgrade houses. What about the food market? No. Let's see. So there's only a couple of things you can upgrade. Well, that's kind of fair. Yeah, so moving uh, day one, can we get a couch stream? You guys will get a couch stream as, f as soon as I find the perfect couch. 
However, what you are going to get is, uh... Uh, what you guys are going to get, yeah, sorry about the hotel internet. Uh, it might be a little crappy. Um. Oh, did it just take the whole stream out? No, I don't think it did. Sorry. Um, but what you guys are going to get is a video, uh, mainly for YouTube, with, uh... Let's see. Supply Workshop. You're going to work on this. Uh, you're going to get a video for YouTube where I'm actually out uh, picking up stuff for the... Uh, sorry. Uh, where I'm out actually picking up couches. Uh, so Or picking out, not picking up. So I'm, I'm very specifically going to just be running around tossing myself on, um, on various couches. Being like, this is a good couch, this is a bad couch. We actually already started filming this. Um, we went to a... Uh, we went to a furniture store, a pretty decent one too, uh, a couple days ago, and it was actually really nice. And so I wanted, I want to do it again. Um, but obviously, kind of dependent on on time and energy, and me not being sick. Uh, okay. Well, at the very least, we've got conveyor belts going. How's the research going? So we're actually having paper problems. Yeah, go figure. Uh, let's see. How much lumber do I have sitting around in this base? Not as much as I'd like. I'm gonna start rerouting some of the lumber here. Okay, there we go. But yeah, so, uh, my hope is we can have, like, a nice, big, uh, Video of me just plopping myself on actually hundreds of, uh, hundreds of couches. Some were really good. Most were kind of bad, actually. But picking out the perfect couch takes some serious time. Okay, so this workshop is, is Dunsky for now. I probably am going to want to do more with it. Uh, let's see. Is this, okay, output's good. Probably because we're doing cloth right now. Yeah, I still have... Workers available, so I can I can do more if I want to. Honestly, I think what we're going to do. Let's do the really, I'm gonna say it boring thing. Uh, flatten up. Get out of here, beautiful natural river environment. I never wanted you anyway. Give me room so I can get a forester up in here, and really start supplying this this whole tree shenanigans. Or this school shenanigans. Oh, shoot. I needed a little bit of that water, didn't I? Hmm. Well, that's unfortunate. Anyway, who cares about natural natural waterways? I have industry magics. Okay, good. So what are my criteria for a couch? Something that I can sit on for hours on end. Something that I can uh, sit up in and lean back without like having to like really put the feet up. So it needs to be kind of kind of squishy. And it needs some kind of headrest, because I'm going to be in this couch for upwards of six hours sometimes. And that can get dicey. Okay, so I'm going to build a forester here. Okay, it's also going to get us some apples, interestingly enough. Hmm. Output's pretty good, though. Okay, we want to do paths, road. Build, worker, wagon. Okay, so we also want to do farming, mining. Can I plant some tree? Tree planters. Requires iron plates. Well, that's fine. This thing outputs pretty quick anyway. And I can make it so much faster! Wait. Oh. Oh, snap. I didn't realize it, but the Forester requires red money. Oh. Okay, we're probably fine.
but that is that's a bit spooky. Okay. How are you doing? We're not applying fertilizer. We don't have any. And honestly, I'm going to turn that off. Until we until we have more consistently here. Okay. Well, at least it'll keep it flush with wood. Pretty easily. So it's probably a worthwhile endeavor. So your resource is infinite in this game. Uh, after like an, in, an initial bit, yeah. Yeah, they're completely infinite. Man, uh, I do have to give this game credit. Factorio made sense. Trying to dig through some of this and figuring out like the proper efficient setup is actually maddening. I think I need I think I need to spare one of these guys, worker. Let's see, supply workshop. Uh crap. This asshole just decided to bring wood there because that's what the bar okay. <sighs> There's so much going on. Since it was late now, I feel like I missed so much. I don't understand anything. I mean, it's Factorio. Let's let's be let's be honest here. This this game is just straight up Factorio. Slightly different, but ultimately very very functional uh, similarities. See, did I ever finish a modded Factorio run? I did with uh. We we did uh we did a complete run of Factorio with uh let's see what was it called Mastorio that was that was modded and it was amazing. At some point I'll do a modded run myself, but not right now. So how do we do this? Because my main problems are just ingest problems. Increase that speed a little bit. I mean, we are probably gonna. What are we doing on logistics? We're doing okay on logistics. I'm just gonna pump some extra workers in that. Because I've got enough. I've got enough red. Red coins that I don't need to worry about it too much. It's going to get kind of pricey. Okay, so five is the functional maximum. we got to make my people happier if I want to do more. Now I want Wanda to play Fortress Calf Evolved. I would like to someday. What other recipes can we do? No, we can just do paper. I think there's a, a better means. Paper, books, and enchanted books. Okay, so at some point I'm going to want to restructure this whole setup. But no, I, I'd i like to play Fortress Craft Evolved. It seems like a neat game. If I remember it, I actually... I think the developer is tweeting about maybe sending it to me uh, a while back, but I never like responded because I was super busy and I didn't know if I had time. I'm still not sure if I have time, honestly. At least not initially. Okay. So let's probably keep doing farm tiles here. Cuz I might as well I might as well maximize this sucker. Let's see. Farming, we want cotton. Cuz I I've got effectively infinite money. So I can just kind of... I'm not going to say take my time, but still. Okay, so we don't 
have any more for at least a little while. Probably want to expand a little bit over on this side, too. Let's see, have I ever played Plague Incorporated or Panic Pandemic 2? Nope. Those are games that uh, people have asked for repeatedly, but I've never had the uh, the time to sit down and say, like, yeah. You know, I'll do a series on those. Oh, crap. Um, select recipe. Stop appling. It's still outputting them. Oh, that's why. Can I have, like, a worker pull apples off? Nope. Okay, so let's let's get them let's get them apples out of here first. I should probably store them elsewhere, but ugh. At least I'm glad I can turn off so it doesn't it doesn't harvest apples cuz I don't I don't need those right now. Someday, yeah. But right now, no. Okay, so are you done? Yeah. B paths. Not not a road. Cloth conveyor belt. Okay, so that that frees up a wagon to do business. I don't know what said bi business is going to be, but it should help. Okay. What was the problem I had over here? Why couldn't I do this? Did I just not have enough uh, conveyor belts? Probably. Oh no, we needed splitters. That's why. That's why I can't do what I want to do. And I don't want to turn off. I don't want to turn off. Okay. Oh, it's fine. At least it's possible to filter what's gathered up. Yep. Decent, decent system, if you ask me. Okay, so you... Oh boy, you can get a lot of workers just spitting cotton here. It's fine, I think. Okay, so we've we've hit our population cap, but that's that's fine. I don't I can I can work around it. 